presidents really do hate leaks. They hate them with a passion. Whether it is Trump or Biden, any of them hate leaks within their administration. But in South Sudan, we have a president who was... I'm going to play this clip for you. This is for real. You'll, you'll hear this music, and you will think that I put this music in there. I did not put this music in here to make it even more comical than it already is. Uh, this is a president who's standing at attention with a bunch of, um, of his officials there. And as he's standing at attention, he starts wetting himself. And you can see this dark stain start on his pants and move down. And then starts to puddle at his feet. At uh, one point, he looks down to see what is happening. (laughs) That's their actual national anthem. (laughs) Now he looks down. (laughs) And everybody else is looking at this long puddle that is dripping down. And then whoever is running this looks over at the crowd, and they're all looking at the puddle. Look at this guy's face. Even though he's got a mask on, it's pretty amazing. He's frowning like, what is going on with this? Now, as a result of that, leaking out (laughs) on social media, uh, the president has now arrested six journalists. Uh, They were there representing state media government media. So they did not put that, (laughs) they knew better than to put that on air. But after a week or so, uh, it um, made its way to social media and six journalists have now been detained over that. Uh, It shows, um, uh, (laughs) as you see the dark puddle going down there, the journalists who work for the state run South Sudanese Broadcasting Corporation were detained uh, on Tuesday and Wednesday. They said, um, and they um, have not been released. And according to Sudanese law, the police are supposed to release suspects um, after 24 hours. Um, they're not allowed to detain suspects for only 24 hours before bringing them to a judge. So they should have been brought before a judge, arraigned or whatever. Uh, but that hasn't happened. They've just kind of disappeared. Uh, The incident matches a pattern of security personnel resorting to arbitrary detention whenever officials deem coverage unfavorable. Now, I just ask you, are are we that different from uh, this third world dictatorship here? We have a president, which (laughs) any day an incident like that could literally happen with, uh, with Biden. It all just depends, right? common man. They created common core to dumb down our children. They created common past to track and control us. Their commons project to make sure the commoners own nothing and the communist future. They see the common man as simple, unsophisticated, ordinary. But each of us has worth and dignity created in the image of God. That is what we have in common. That is what they want to take away. Their most powerful weapons are isolation, deception, intimidation. They desire to know everything about us while they hide everything from us. It's time to turn that around and expose what they want to hide. Please share the information and links you'll find at thedavidnightshow.com. Thank you for listening. Thank you for sharing. If you can't support us financially, please keep us in your prayers. TheDavidKnightShow.com